guys i hope that you guys are doing amazing wherever you are i'm so grateful that you guys are watching listening and subscribing to my channel i know i say this every video but it's literally me thanking you guys every single time for being around for watching for my, my showing of my gratitude i really feel like i really want to do that every single time because i i feel so grateful and i don't know if just words are enough for it i want you guys to feel it in this video i wanted to speak to you guys about the myth of the good little infj Oh man, I hate that myth. It's so annoying to me because always everyone always thinks that we're like good people, we're nice people, we're supposed to be kind. And when we are not good little INFJs, when we kind of lash out a little bit or we show our rage or we show our negative side or we show our evil side, whatever that means to you, everyone just thinks that we're being, we're throwing a tantrum, that we're being crazy. Why are you being like that? Why can't you just always be good? Why can't, I, why can't you just be nice all the time? We're not always nice. Actually, in fact, it's so funny to me because I'm actually a complete bitch. It's actually really funny because you guys look at me and you, maybe you think I'm nice. I hope not. I hope you can see that I'm an absolute bitch. But actually, I am a, a major horribly bitchy person. Like, I have a lot of bitchy thoughts in my head, you know. <clears throat> and it's funny because I come across for some, re some odd reason as a really good person, a really nice person. It really annoys me because I, when I show my bitchy side to people, they're like, where is this coming from? Are you having a bad day? Are you PMSing? And I'm thinking to myself, no, this is me, guys. This is me. I'm mean. I'm a bitch. I am mean to people. I say mean things about people. I think mean thoughts about people. So there is this myth that's perpetuated around us for some reason. I have no idea why. People look at me and they think I'm nice. I have no idea why. They always think that I'm nice. I am not. Just get it through your head. I'm not. And I tell this to people all the time. And I'm always warning people. I am not nice. Don't be friends with me. And they're still friends with me and they still are surprised when I'm not nice. It's so weird to me. So please, please, please stop perpetuating this myth of the good little INFJ. We're not good and we're not little and we're not nice. <laughs> it's such a weird thing that I have to say this out loud because it's weird because we show our true colors a lot of times and then the people get surprised that it happens and then they give us another chance and they're like, no, no, you're always good, aren't you? You're, you're, you're a good person. And I saw, I'll tell them, no, I'm not. Listen to me. Listen to me. I am not a good person. I'm mean. And I am horrible. And just get it through your head that I'm like that. And I'll tell them that, right? And then I'll hope that they understand. And then the next time I display anger or frustration or rage or evilness, they get surprised again. And I think to myself, did I not warn you a few days ago, a few months ago? Like, I told you this is how I am. Why aren't you not listening? The same thing when I start dating someone. I always warn them about this, you know, like, I'm not a good person. I'm probably going to end up hurting you. I'm probably going to be a horrible person to you in the end. I'm warning you about this. If you still want to date me, then fine, date me. But I've warned you. Don't tell me that I didn't warn you. I always start off like that. And then it does end up like that. you know. And then they look at me like, who are you? I didn't expect you to be like this. And I say to them, ma'am, I, I told you about this. I told you from the beginning that I'm like this. Why are you being like this? Like, Why are you not believing me? For some reason, people don't believe us. It's just weird. It's a it's a random myth that's been perpetuated by people that INFJs are, you know, beautiful, kind, caring individuals are always nice and they never get angry and they never get frustrated and blah, blah, blah. We're still human people. We're still human. We still have human thoughts. We still have human feelings. We're still evil. We still have bitchy thoughts. We still get angry. We still have all of that stuff. For some reason, we have been perpetuated as saints and we are not. We are not saints. I am not a saint and I don't want to be perpetuated as one because I want to be myself. And because of this myth, we can't be ourselves. We always have to be nice. We always have to be kind. We always have to be caring. Sometimes I don't want to be caring. Sometimes you're blabbing on about your issues, about your your uh, stuff, your miseries. And I just want to be like, I'm sorry. I don't want to listen to this today. I'm too tired. Or I've heard this a billion times before. Can you just get over yourself? That's what I actually want to say. But because I'm supposed to be nice, because we're supposed to be counselors, I mean, I do care, yes, but not all the time. Because we're counselors, because we're supposed to be nice, we can't just be like, no, I'm sorry, but I just don't want to hear your bullshit today. I'm sorry, I just don't want to hear you griping all the time. Can you just shut up? Or can you just go and realize that you have a great life and can you stop complaining about everything? That's usually what I want to say. <laughs> I say it in my head. So it does happen in my head sometimes. Mostly, I have a hard time saying it out loud because, you know, I, I just can't. I have a hard time with it. But it doesn't mean that I'm a nice person. I still have horrible, evil thoughts. 
And so please stop perpetuating this myth. We are not good, we're not kind, we're not nice, we're not caring all the time. We have moments of bitchiness, we have moments of horribleness, whatever you want to call it, right? And so I really, really wanted to do this video because I, I, I get annoyed by people. They're like, oh, why are you being like this? Why are you being like this? You're usually so nice. And I think to myself, uh, hello, I'm being human. I have good days and I have bad days. And I have days when I'm nice and kind and good, rarely. And I have days where mostly I just want to be a bitch and I want to be on my own. I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk to anyone. I want to be by myself. I want to be mean. I want to say mean things about people. You know, I want to be that person who gossips about other people. Well, not really, but things like that, you know? <laughs> I don't know if this makes sense to you guys, but this myth has to be broken off. It has to be cut off right at its, at its root. So when you meet a new person, you know, tell them right away, I am an INFJ. I might seem like a nice person, but I'm not. Just get it through your head. I'm not. I always warn people about it. I, every person I meet, they always say, oh, you're so nice. And I'm thinking to myself, no, I'm not. And I always tell them, no, no, I'm not. I am nice right now to you because I am in the space and mood right now, but I'm not always nice. And you will notice that sometimes I'll be mean to you and you will get surprised by it. Please don't be surprised. I am a horrible human being and if you are, if you know what's good for you, then you won't be friends with me. And usually, weirdly enough, I had this conversation with people and they just laugh it off. They're like, ha ha, you're just being so funny. And I think to myself, why can't you just believe me? Why can't you just understand that this is the truth? I don't know. I don't know what to do about it. I just, I just, I warn them and it doesn't really work. I don't know. Sometimes I just blab on, blab on and I have no idea what I'm talking about. Maybe I'm delirious. I do have a little bit of a fever, I feel. Or I'm just using that as an excuse. But again, I hope this makes sense to you guys. You know, I, I implore you guys to break that myth as soon as possible. We are not good little INFJs. We are mean. We are bitches. We are bastards. We are all of that. You know, and that's fine. That's all right. You don't have to be good all the time. You can be mean, that's all right. You don't have to be a perfect, perfect person all the time. In fact, the more that we can show our negative, or negative, or our true sides to people, the more connections that we build are going to be stronger, you know? You can't always be perfect. I don't want to be friends with the perfect person. I want to be friends with a person who has no idea what they're doing sometimes, you know, who has those moments where they're crazy, who has moments where they feel insane, who has moments where they're yelling and screaming and, you know, bring the house down, you know, things like that. Right? So I don't want to be friends with a person like that and I'm sure other people don't want to be friends with a perfect human being either. So show yourself, show your true colors to people and I'm sure your friendships that you're going to build are going to be stronger. Be vulnerable, show your imperfections and that's when I feel like the true connections are built. I hope this makes sense to you guys. I really, really, really have been wanting to do this video for a long time. Maybe more as a rant for myself. I hate when people think I'm nice. Uh, but also to kind of show you guys what it's all about. Maybe, hopefully, mm -hmm. this makes sense. I hope that you guys have an amazing day wherever you are. Thank you again for watching, for listening, for being around. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.